Hey guys, what's up? In today's video, you're going to find some beauty products that I purchased at a store recently, along with some odds and ends that I purchased that I thought it would be a great idea just to share with you guys. even if you don't wear like makeup they're always good to just get the uh, natural oils off of your skin um, these blending sponges are you can use both sides and I just like to use them you know just to sometimes to do touch-ups underneath the eyes or the corners of my eyes just to get the oils off your skin and these are the blending beauty blending sponges with the with two tip sponges for concealing and blending so i really like those and i bought them from ross and guys they were only 3.99 and you probably can get them at the dollar store in a bundle but you can't go wrong 3.99 another product i really like i purchased i got this from marshall's and guys it was only 4.99 slay all day i thought this would be a good item to store like your makeup brushes in there toothbrushes or whatever but yeah it was only like 4.99 from marshall's another product that i really really like oh this body butter y'all pistachio body butter skincare use it after bathing really really love the smell of pistachios on your skin oh, it smells just so wonderful and i don't know but how many of you guys like sulfate soaps i'm really a soap connoisseur but for some reason this dove normally i do not like soaps with you know sodium um the lye made from pig skin or whatever but this is supposed to be a plant-based moisturizer guy naturally derived cleanser so i got this on sale at i think it's a sister of ross's it's called bb's and this is your actual 25.3 ounces i only paid like five dollars for it and it has the cocoa butter pamper your skin some almond so and I thought that would be a really good smell let me smell that again actually it's not the one that I was looking for but still it's a really good price you get a whole lot for your money's worth if you needed to share it in your you know bathroom your guest bathroom or whatever. Can't go wrong. Got it at these. Oh, right there. It is the facial pore cleanser. Now, you don't have to use this like every day. It just depends on, you know, what condition your skin is in. But it has like four suction cups on it and it's made by L. And I found this for $12.99. That product there. Very nice. Judy products. Yes. Judy products. Okay. I found these nail tips. I have a whole lot of them and I'm not going to use them. But I tried them for my first two weeks and I just couldn't um, continue to use them because it's too much for me but um yeah because i like you know using my hands but um they are um kiss nail tips and it's a whole kit with the glue i don't even know how much 
I think I got them at um, Walmart. Probably Walmart. Yes. Okay. Today I picked these up at Target. The dark chocolate Himalayan salted almonds. And guys, you can only eat a little bit of these at a time. Yeah. What else did I purchase? Oh, I had to tell myself this. Not everything needs to be perfect. Because y'all, you guys know I'm a Virgo. And the Virgos love to overdo stuff to the extreme. And everything has to be to perfection. So I thought this was a great reminder to tell me not everything needs to be perfect. Okay? <laughs> anyway, what else did I find? What else? Did, oh, this the Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Casserole. Really love this product. It's an excellent deep conditioner. I used this last night on my hair. And this time I decided to leave it on longer than the directions required. And um, yes, I swear by this. And in this, I never had the squeeze bottle before. Usually I have the uh, 8 ounce containers. But this... It looks like the texture is a little bit different, but there's no, the scent, it doesn't really smell like anything, you know, flowery fragrance or anything like that. But at the same time, it does wonders to your hair. So I love that. Um, I used the Maui Moisture Hair Care with coconut oil. I purchased that and remember I said that um, you know I, I shop around bargain shop I didn't pay store prices for that but I know that they have this at Target they also have this at um, Target but I didn't pay Target prices for it what else do I have to, to, oh oh I just recently did a purchase my um, cell phone case. Let me see. I really, really, really love this cell phone case. I thought that was a good purchase. I've been looking for a cell phone case that is me. And this cord, this is an Amazon cord. I have it plugged into my computer. I was Amazon Basics. I don't know. I found this cord for like $2 at another shopping hall but this cell phone case was um, about ten dollars so that's not bad it's not bad at all oh one more thing I am um, was on this YouTube channel before I go over that I'm gonna do this way I don't know why but I'm a sucker for trying, you know, everything once. These, the invisible push-up bras, they work. I tried them. I like them. I'm happy. They free your girls up. So I suggest try a pair. Tell me what you think. The invisible push-up bras, very nice. Okay. And then... Oh, okay. So I was on this YouTube channel. So this is a lost art, right? To be able to crochet. So, um, yes. I've been crocheting. I don't know. Wait, let me show you what I did. <laughs> this. I'm going to try and turn this into a shirt, believe it or not. I saw... A crocheting channel and um, it was really inspiring I tried to find things that channels that inspire me and so yes it kind of woke my crocheting back up okay guys so thank you for watching fearless meadows bye thank you for watching please leave comments like and subscribe 